Hello everyone! Today we are just going to add a button to our main form in order to open up our add customer form um, as like a pop-up form. Um, so to do that we just need to get a command button here. Um, let's make it that big. Um, cancel out of the wizard. Um, I'm going to call it cmd add customer. And then as the caption, we'll put add customer as well. Um, let's color it. Hmm, what color is this one? Background, Just copy that. There we go. Just resize it a bit. And then go to the events and then click on to unclick and there we can see that we do actually have a sub um, written in that already because we copied it from the add customer form if you remember um, but we'll just remove all of that and all we need to add in here is do command dot open form and then the name of the form that we want to open which is form add customer um, we can just see that there um, just check that there are lots of other um, options that we can add on to here like filters and stuff but because we're just opening a plain unbound form uh, it's nice and simple. So what we need to do in our add form form load sub is I'm just going to remove the do command maximize because um, I don't want it to maximize anymore I just want it to be like a small pop-up form um, and then so what we would also need to do is oh, click into there um, so that we've got our add customer form open and then click into other and there's an option here for pop-up which is currently no so we're just going to save that to yes and run this form and yeah just make sure it's the size that you want sometimes it opens up massive and if so you can just um, resize it there using the normal resize buttons so let's just save that um, and then where should I put that button let's put it there for now um, we'll do something with that later on um, so if I just run this form now and then click on to add customer we can see there that our pop-up form opens. Um, I think next time actually we'll create a close button in here so that we can close the form as well. Um, and I want to change that highlight. What colour's that got? Yeah, do you know what? It's just easier if I delete that one and copy this one and then I know that it's going to be the same colouring. Um, so let's just change this again. We'll call it back to add customer. And the caption is add customer. Sorry, I'm repeating myself now. Um, clear the image, no picture. Um, yes. Resize that um, and then just add the event back onto it there. And save that and let's just make sure it still works. There we go. So now the button's the same and when we click it, it acts the same as this one instead of still being blue. Um, it's quite often just easier to copy and paste your buttons rather than add all the um, properties on individually. So yes, that's it. Um, as I said, next time I'll show you how to add a close button to close the open form. Um, and then we can do some, I don't know, more stuff with the rest of this app. <laughs> So if you found this tutorial useful, please do like it and subscribe to our channel and feel free to add any comments below. Thank you for watching.